purpose of all of that, um, what, what, what's going on? Interaction. Interaction. Fun. Fun. What's that? Creating interest. Yeah, creating interest. It's, it's like, admittedly, she's one of those personalities that can pull it off. But, you know, it's just something for us to remember the importance of. That's why I love stuff like Lucky Dips and stuff, because people, we're just humans. We love doing stuff, you know, and the more you can interact and do stuff, uh, it, it makes it more enjoyable and more memorable. Even financial planners and garbage bin people, you know, it could be, you know, go to the secret Lucky Dip and pick out your secret bit of garbage. You know, who knows? You know, so, oh, God. No, you're not really garbage. <laughs> garbage. Okay, so all good? Look to the person next to you and say, geez, you're amazing. Let's continue. Okay, so you think we've done this a few times, guys? Yes. Yeah, okay. But again, is it simple so far? Yeah. No, no having to go to a four-year degree in, you know, business development, mastery, really simple, right? Okay, so these are just quickly the interactive brochures. So this here, um, Michael Elcorn, a good buddy of mine and client in Mission Accounting, he put a list there which was, would you like easy to use accounting software, access to current business performance information? He just had his questions there. And he just said, when we catch up, take that with you. Yes, no, some. You know, really simple uh, and great tool because all of a sudden what he found was uh, when he's meeting with people, they had a bit of a conversation point and it's called doing the thinking work for our prospects, which is, you know, they're going through and they're having a chat and Mick, extreme introvert, hello. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's Mick, he's a lovely guy. But seriously, that's, that's what he did. Outstanding, because now when he went in and had a meeting, but here's the thing which we'll talk about, he gave them a call, followed them up, had a meeting, saw it all the way through the seven steps. Cool. All right, is anyone running a checklist or some sort of performer or something like that? Very good, okay. So the important thing is, ladies and gentlemen, is uh, like someone I did here, don't lose them, keep them, yeah, because you're going to go, oh, where's my forms with those details, yeah? And again, because of time, uh, and um, thank you to this gentleman too, that's my too busy list. This one here, even if you have a stapler, just staple their card, keep it quick, right? Because data entry and all that stuff in the day's time. Okay, how does our stand look? Now, it's, uh, it's important, and Paul is going to talk to you about this more in a minute, but, you know, you, all I'm going to say for me is it's nice to make it look great, but, you know, Fun, easy, but don't do the bank on it, okay? We want to have brochures, we want to have our banners if you can, interactive documents if you're playing some <coughs> games. But just, um, actually, I went to Paula Stunder, she will share some stuff on banners and the, the secrets to banners and those things. But um, everyone's good on the, on the stand? Mm -hmm. yep? yep, okay? Balloons aren't they banned now, or? Yes, no. Um, I think condoms are banned, but I don't know about that point. Not that I'm aware of. Yeah, I don't know. <coughs> so, yeah, maybe. I don't know. But, um, what is this? They're coming in, you just pop them if they say that's illegal, but I don't think that's an issue. Okay, and guys, you're going to have a chance for questions, and we're going to be here at the end, so I'll just move through it, okay? Now, I know you guys love to follow up. I know you love it, right? You love it. There's some people that don't. I know it's crazy, right? But some people don't like following up. I don't know what's wrong with them, but all cheekiness aside, you're going to meet people and there's this thing afterwards which is the follow-up, yeah? Now, just from me and my telling you experience, and I know I'm speaking to a lot of very smart, successful people in the room, my simple process is, I will always send a thank you email, or it's really nice to meet them. I will quite often do something a bit funny, which is just my personality, and also, again, a little bit of being remembered, but, you know, um, I don't know if you've ever seen the movie uh, where Taken with Liam Nielsen, mm -hmm. and he says, I will find you. Yeah. I found this picture, and he's on the phone, and says, I will find you, and I will thank you. And I got that in the email. So, generally, it gets a good response, and it's just, 
Hi, John, really nice to meet you. As a matter of course, I'm just following up. I'll speak to you in a few days where we can talk a bit more about this, that, and the other. Really looking forward to chatting to you further to see if and how we can work together. And that's it. Most don't even ever reply. Most ever never reply. Mm -hmm. Not you guys, but a lot of people don't reply to emails apparently. So they don't reply, and then the next thing is the call and then the meeting. Okay? And the contacts go to my database. Um, and I'm sure a lot of you already do this, okay? I'm preaching the converted. Um, and we do what we said we would do. We, uh, we call them, we connect, we recap. And for you guys, if you're really diligent about this, I always make a few notes on the really kind of important people where we're really connected. Not that not everyone's important, but you know, there's some people that are gonna be like, you know, we, we're really a good match here. Uh, and I'll make some notes so we can recap on those. We have the meeting. And, um, you know, I, I, I did have stalked them, but, you know, tracked them till they're seen all the way through. But don't go stalking anyone. Okay. I don't have time to go through this with you guys today, but there is a process called the How to Meet and Enroll a Client. And simply, even if you followed that process, if no one's ever been trained on actually how to have a meeting or a phone call or a presentation to effectively enroll someone into being happy paying clients, uh, this is some work that I do. If you ever want to have a chat to me about it, there's some things here that we can fill in if you want to do that. But simply, ladies and gentlemen, when you follow up, make sure that you do it properly. You connect, you frame up what you want to do, you explore their needs, you look at how you can create value and confirm it to fit and enroll them either to proposal or to buy from you. Um, you know that process, guys, right? Okay. So as you can see, we are now way out of the expo, and we're now on the phone talking to people, right? It is all the seven steps, true? So what happens is out there in the world of unsuccessful people at, uh, or less than effective people at trade shows and expos is, the follow-up is where they fall over, okay? You know, so do we all get, okay, why don't you just repeat after me and say, Trevor, <laughs> I, love I love to follow up. Oh. Because, because I'm amazing. I'm amazing. <laughs> there we go. All right. So that's Jace very quickly, and that's what he talked about was the plan. Okay. Here's to your expo success. All right. And it goes like this: We want to get our positive, determined, proactive, courageous on. Yes or yes? Yes. 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 We want to be out the front of our beautiful stand, whether we've got one brochure or we've got the whole <coughs> show there, to be talking and connecting with people, and Paul will talk more about that in a minute. We want to have a goal for the day, yeah, an intention. We want to be prepared and we want to know what we're going to say. Yes, Trevor? Yes. Yes? Okay. And we want to know how we're going to wow them, whether it's a game or a lucky like dip or a competition or a checklist. So it's fun and engaging. And we're going to follow them up. I know you guys love following them up, but it's just for the video people here because, you know, we want to help people out there, right? Okay, and we're going to consult with them, whether it's a, you know, a simple phone call to book in their first garbage bin clean or whether it's all the way to selling them a seven-year financial plan for the rest of their lives or they're going to go into a whole technology printing system on a, on a three-year lease, whatever it is that you're taking them to. All good? Okay, now if anyone ever wants to have a chat to me, I've got some things over here where we can catch up. There's a book that I wrote. I wrote a book. Well yeah! <laughs> I tell myself all the time. It's a darn good book too, let me tell you. Right. Grow sales, more clients, fix marketing, innovate, improve team, clarity, a plan. That's all the stuff that I do. Be a pleasure now or any time in the future. And uh, I think I'm going to just get you guys to stand up quickly, okay? And I've just got a quick thing that I'm going to get you guys to do. You guys like this? You guys like this? Really simple. Hands up like that. I'm going to get you to say after me, and it goes like this. Put your fingers up like this. And you go, Trevor. Trevor. I can. I can. I will. I will. I, will. I, must, I must. Tell Paula. Tell Paula. She's amazing. She's amazing.